never looked so good. Even celebrating her 65th birthday on February 2nd, the model still looks like she hasn't aged one bit since she burst onto the scene in the 70s. I honestly have had years in my life where I'd be like, wait a minute, how old am I again? Brinkley exclusively reveals in the new issue of Us Weekly. I just don't think about it. Fortunately, her ageless face, which stems from good genes, clean living and health therapy treatments, doesn't reveal the years of hard work and personal tribulations she had to endure over the years. Still, she remains humble about her appearance. When I started doing the Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue in 1979, I was very concerned about trying to live up to the image they projected of this hot body in a bathing suit, the National Lampoon's vacation actress explains. I'm kind of in the same situation with aging. Aging is inevitable. If I'm lucky, I'm going to be running around as an older woman with my hard-earned wrinkles. It's inevitable. And she feels the most confident she's ever been. Around 50, you start letting yourself off the hook, and you have a real awareness of priorities and what really matters, the Bellissimo Prosecco founder continues. Others' opinions just don't have power over you anymore. The only opinions that really matter to you are those of the people you love. Go inside Brinkley's birthday bash in the video above and hear all about why this is her best year yet. And for even more on her proudest moments and biggest regret, pick up the new issue of Us Weekly on Stands Now.